Hey guys, how's it going? Long time no see, but I'm back. I had to take a good long break because some things were annoying me, but I'm, I'm back now. Yeah, and I um, missed you guys, missed, uh, missed reacting to stuff, missed YouTube, but and uh, I saw another South Park come and I thought, well, I've got to do it. I've got to react to this. I love South Park so fucking much and I've been buzzing about this for as long as I've known about it. I think I've only known about it for a week, um, but here it is. It's come around and it's time to get into it. Um, yeah, without further ado, guys, let's, let's just go. Warning. The following mm. program contains the actual sound of an obesity drug being injected into Trey Parker's stomach. Viewer discretion is advised. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm just yeah, I, I hate, pressure, hate getting my fucking blood pressure attack. Ms. Cartman, I'm extremely worried about your son's health. <laughs> His ass hanging His out. Blood pressure. Well, there might be another answer. Have you heard of semaglutides? <laughs> the music. Say They're what? the active ingredient can help obese people lose vast amounts of weight. I want some of that. Really? How would you like to not be fat anymore? Oh. Oh, hey, is this? Guys. Is this his imagination? How's it going? Hey, he's suddenly you happy. What? You're a dumb bitch. Oh <laughs> no, yeah. he's not changed yeah. at all. You're a dumb bitch and you got saggy tits. Oh yeah, Cartman. Well, you're a. You're a. Uh, yep, she got nothing. <laughs> Sweet! <laughs> okay! Cal, guess what? You're a totally ugly ginger and your religion is fucking bullshit! <laughs> oh yeah! Well, you're a... Yeah, you're what, are you, a... what are you gonna say, Cal? Damn it! <laughs> yeah! <I'm done. laughs> the animation! Hey! Oh you're shit! Your country is fucking dumb and it smells like ass! Okay, Pakistan, why don't you get your shit together? They're taking fucking shots, oh, yeah. what the fuck? <laughs> Where? Could this really happen? It's about twelve hundred dollars a month. Oh, Fuck I don't know if we can afford that. Oh, all right. Well, never mind, Eric. Have a good day. <laughs> never mind, Doctor. Please, I've been fat my whole life. I hate how I look. Please, there has to be something you can do. He's just not willing to do diet and exercise. All right, I'm gonna write you a prescription for Lizzo. Lizzo? Oh. She's a really good singer who. And I'm afraid you'll have to be on Lizzo for the rest of your life. <laughs> no! Lizzo, no! <laughs> to that brave new world, you know? Indulge, 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 shoot yourself up, but don't put nothing on. Better than throwing up and losing your teeth. What's with the music? What's she wearing? Whoa, 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 where are you going? <laughs> with her belly out. <laughs> Not looking like that, you aren't. Not looking like what? We've talked about this, Shelly. You don't go to school wearing shirts that show off your body like that. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to be something ridiculous. It's really just the fashion now, Randy. Do you not remember the Paris Hilton episode? I don't want my innocent little daughter going to school dressed like a cum whore. Go put on a different shirt. Wear it. Mama and he said I could wear it. You're stupid. The school says girls can wear shirts like this, so I can do what I want. Okay, cool. Then maybe I'll just wear whatever I want to school to come pick you up later. That's the way to do it. That's the best way to do it. I think it's fine when girls wear them. What I can't stand is all the middle-aged moms wearing them now because they're all on Ozempic. Oh, hey, guys. Oh. How's it going? Just For fuck's sake. Hi, Linda. With the abs. Uh... No, I'm not cold. Not with all the running I'm doing lately to work on my core. Mm -hmm. Hey, ladies. Boy, it sure is chilly out this morning, huh? <laughs> yeah, I sure hope summer comes soon. With the crow's uh, feet oh, and the yeah. weird... Yeah. We gotta get going. We'll this see is too around. much. Drugs? I'm not taking any drugs. I'm just hiking and lifting weights. It's like steroids for moms. You don't have to be shy with us. Hey, Cal. Cal, can you come talk to Eric for a minute? He's really upset. Carmen's upset? So what? He's been crying all day, and now he's just sitting on the merry-go-round all by himself. What's wrong with you? Nothing. Okay, Carmen, obviously something's wrong. I'm just fat. And I'm always gonna be fat. And I'm just a poor fat kid. Poor little fat kid. <laughs> Buzz. Okay, carbon. They're kind of new drugs, and so the only people that can get them are people who can pay twelve hundred bucks a month, and then the rest of us get this. <laughs> Lizzo. Okay. It's a prescription for Lizzo. Rich people get Ozempic. Poor people get body positivity. They can't just <laughs> oh, get medication for rich people. Let's go down there and talk to them. She, that new cow could help. When it comes to your health, you gotta be tough, dude. You gotta have some fucking willpower, okay? Mm, tell him, Carl. Okay. Oh, go on, Randy. Oh, hey! Hey, Shelly! 
Over here, Shelly! Right here! It's Dad! <laughs> no, really he's Billy. Up. Oh my god. What? What's the problem, Shelly? Come on, sweetheart! Just <laughs> the way he's just fucking Sweet. melting. On, oh, hey, Randy. Look at you. Uh -oh. oh, she's into it? So you're up. You're doing the thing too, huh? Well, yeah, I'm into drugs. <laughs> yeah, me too. Whoa, really? Yeah, I love them. Well, I'm more into drugs than probably anyone in this town. At Laura Tucker's house tomorrow lunch. Come hang with the girls and we can share drugs. <laughs> it's not what he thought. Insurance. Great company name. No, we're not here to give you money. We're here to file a claim for my friend's medication. Oh, then oh, fuck you. You want money from us? Right through that door over there. The exit. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. It's the sloth from fucking Zoo, whatever it's called. Zootopia. Yeah, this guy's a fucking asshole. The medical director's job is just to say no. Conspiracy theory, but is this why people have been trying to make obesity out to be a disease this whole time? Ready for insurance claims on Osempic? Did they know something we didn't? <laughs> Oprah said so. Down. Oh, hey, Randy. Oh, she Girl, fucking. She, Randy says he has a she was like. Really good shit. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, so everyone, everyone, we have a little surprise for you all. So, Alexis. <laughs> He's looking at the bellies. For the fuck's drugs. sake. She went to Mexico and was able to get a 12 injection sample through customs. Party time, guys. Oh, in a bucket of ice. For fuck's oh, wow. sake. <laughs> Is this going to be the sound of it going into Trey? Is something wrong, Randy? No! No, I'm not as scared. Well, go ahead, Randy. Randy! 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 Randy. He's just high off tummies. <laughs> this is a Taylor Swift concert. Well, here, I made you some bacon and eggs. Uh, no thanks. I'm really not that hungry. Oh, what does it... I don't even know how the drug works. I'm not going to lie to you. Like, does it stem hunger? Last night, I was partying with nine hot MILFs. And this morning, I woke up and guess what? I don't feel like total shit. It's like a miracle drug. You partied all night and felt fine the next morning? Just as the drugs have started getting popular, they've suddenly cut back on demand. Sorry, supply. It's funny that. There's demand has never been higher. And all they gotta do is just fucking synthesize more. Fucked up, you guys don't even understand. What's fucked up? They just purposely make it difficult for people to pay for what they need. Yeah. The insurance companies, the hospitals, and the drug companies, they're making obesity drugs more expensive in America than anywhere else in the world. There's celebrities and rich people using these new drugs to lose a few extra pounds, and meanwhile, Carmen's fat as fuck and can't get any help. <laughs> Dude, we get powder from India and make it into obesity shots for Cartman ourselves? Who needs hospitals and insurance when we have TikTok and YouTube? Yeah, shit, if that ain't the truth. This is gonna be like cash for gold. Yeah, that was a TikTok. Probably real. Was he getting high off looking at bellies? Carl's a fucking smart kid, and fair play for showing out for Carmen like this. I made your favorite pie. Ooh, pie? Yeah, maybe later. Oh, what does it stem hunger? Kids, can you leave the table so I His can arms look skinnier, right? What? What I do? Don't leave. <laughs> Just don't leave. Randy? Just that I'm doing drugs. Are you drunk? Oh, poor Sharon. Oh, and now she's got. It's just gonna be a cycle of fucking guilt and. Yep. Once again, the rich will get everything they want. But, like. <sighs> he hasn't lost a, a pound, has he? What, what, what happened? There's been a nation <laughs> Is she still doing the doctors turn? Doctors are saying some people are abusing the drugs. Well, what else are you supposed you to do be, with drugs? Yeah, yeah. What are we gonna do? The pharmacy on Tanner Street has a whole new supply, so we'll They're bring just gonna in and take them. Do over a pharmacy? Uh, I think, ladies, we can get in a lot of trouble for doing that. Mm. That's right. So we have to make sure nobody knows it's us. Oh, but you're gonna have your fucking bellies out, aren't you? I can feel it now. Stay calm. Yeah. Keep your hands up. This will all be over soon. 
Very Ocean's the lay. He's got his fucking belly out. <laughs> hey, there's some oxycotton and Vicodin. Should I grab that too? No, they're not actually into no? drugs. Okay, can you bring over the injector? The thing is, it takes way more than just one shot, right? Made out of Lego. It's done. You know, Cartman, this could be dangerous. This is, it's not like the nutty danger. professor. This can change my life, Kyle. Let's do it. You feel anything? Well, whoa. Well. I think so. Get me some Cocoa Puffs. What? I need to make a cereal bomb. Get me Cocoa Puffs, Captain Crunch, and a bucket of KFC. Hurry! Oh, that's minging. Oh, milk on KFC. Ugh. Brother, ugh. So what's going on? We don't know. Carmen's been in the bathroom with the bucket of cereal for almost 30 minutes. Dude, Carmen, what are you doing? What is he doing? Testing his, like, resolve? Oh. Look at this. Look at what? Oh, there's a piece there's left. chicken thighs in there. So? So? Do you know the last time I couldn't finish a cereal bomb? I think these drugs totally work. My favorite thing in the world is eating a cereal bomb and taking a shit at the same time to make more room. But I got to the last two slides <laughs> at the bottom and I was like, wait a minute, I think I'm full. Oh I've shit. I've never known that feeling before in my life, you guys. But I'm full. That's... You really can feel a difference? I totally feel a difference. I always drink the chocolatey chicken milk left at the bottom, but it's still sitting there. Oh. Wow! Now we're going to make a whole lot more. Okay. We're not going to just help Cartman. We're going to help everyone in America who can't afford obesity drugs. Our affordable obesity drugs, available to everyone. Mm. We're not here to just make money. We're here to make things fair and to make some money. Our semi-glutide is <laughs> safe and even cheaper than a Little Debbie snack cake. Motherfucker. Shit, son. So just like and subscribe if you want to get on the list, and we will get everyone who wants it. Like and subscribe. Do what the man said. I wonder we'll cut. Uh-oh. <sighs> Oh shit. Is it real or is it a dream? Oh my god! Ooh, whoop, whoop. What are you gonna say back? Nothing! Oh my god, it worked! Hey, you guys! Wow, Cartman? Yeah! You all have zits on your tits! You have big zits <laughs> with tiny tits! Oh, oh yeah! What you got? You got nothing! You wanna know what else I just did? Yeah. You have to shoot your haircut! <laughs> Yeah, he's dreaming, right? Damn, Carmen. Yeah, he was dreaming. Yes. The fuck is this? The fuck is this? Oh well, it's official. It's been one week, and Eric's lost one point three pounds. One point three pounds. Should lose more than that. I'd say it's good. This is so great, you guys. Last night I had a dream about all the amazing things I'm gonna do when I'm skinny. Thank you guys so much. They don't know. So are you ready for your second dose? I'm so ready, Cal. It's really working. This morning for breakfast, Might I can even okay. finish half a cereal bomb on the toilet. Okay, tomorrow maybe let's go for no cereal bombs on the toilet. All right, here's your next dose, Carmen. You know the drill. I sure do. Oh shit! Hey, this is a whole lot. Nobody moving. These Nobody motherfuckers. Hey, Randy, how was the party? It was a. Uh, it was not great. Uh oh. Oh, you didn't rage. Oh, we raged. I think there's something wrong with these drugs. Like I felt satisfied. With any drugs, I always want to do more and more and more. But suddenly with these drugs, I feel like I actually want things less. Does that make any sense? Right. Not at all. It's like, you know, with good drugs, they make you just want and lust. Uh -huh. But uh -huh. those drugs also make your dick not work. But with these drugs, you don't really crave anything. And your dick totally works. It makes you numb. Man, okay. you're talking crazy. Billy, you gotta come quick. What's wrong? It's Eric. He says he's giving up. He, he bought a bunch of junk food and he's gonna mix it all together. Carmen's making another cereal bomb? It's a cereal bomb, but topped with Twinkies and gravy. Jeez, uh, gravy. Oppenheimer. Oppenheimer. Oh my Christ. Well, you gotta hope, Carmen. You hope and you work instead of turning to shit like that. It's all just making it worse, Kyle. Don't you get it? Knowing there's a cure. Knowing I can have willpower injected into my body. Mm, it's willpower injected. I dream about what my future can be like. But I realize now that those dreams are never going to come true. Carmen, your dreams are going to come true. Oh, Kyle. No, if only you yes, knew. Yes, they will. You 
one of the largest manufacturers of semaglutide, was attacked today by body positivity activists. Our own Bill Norman has more. Tom, the advocates for body positivity... That, that's a really good question. A good point. How many of these body positive people are going to be taking Ozempic? We will see. What the hell is wrong with people? Am I just going to stay fucking fat, Kyle? No, we're going to do something else. But the body positivity people are just going to destroy all the drugs and I'm going to be fat. You are not <laughs> going I'm going to be fat. fat. <laughs> yes, Listen, I am. Listen to me. I'm going to be fat You're forever. Not be you fat. can't do anything. We'll get their drugs they have all the They want to keep eating. We're going to be keep fat as fuck, Kyle. you are going to fucking figure it out. <laughs> with all the Lizzo you've been taking, you've given yourself diabetes. <laughs> what? I have diabetes? Diabetes. It's a mild form of diabetes that occurs mostly in the ears. It's something you'll have to manage uh, for the rest. Now I can write you a prescription for Ozempic. It's like, now it's too late. You can have the drugs. Come on, dude. You don't want to do this. Ugh. Trying to talk Cartman down from a fucking Oppenheimer. That's a brilliant name, by the way. Yes, I do. Yeah, I do. Eric, there's so much to live for. What's he doing? Carmen's in there with a cereal bomb that he says is ten times more destructive than an Oppenheimer. He says it's called a Stormy Daniels. <laughs> Carmen, Carmen, stop. I have a solution. For Please, God's I'm sake. I'm going down with a Stormy Daniels. <laughs> no, Carmen, stop eating. I found more semaglutide. No, yeah, I'll do it. I'll fucking do it. <laughs> They're all back in the Go easy, Carmen. They let me order a whole truck of raw powder wholesale. The app says the truck is already almost here. See? As soon as it gets here, we can make you another dose, and you'll have your willpower back. Oh no. Got some construction going on. <laughs> Looking at it her seems belly. Seems kind of inappropriate to wear a midriff shirt while working, don't it? Take your foot off the pedal! How much semaglutide you got in the back? Hey! Fuck this! You're bad people! I'm gonna get the fuck away from you! Hey! Oh shit, they are bad people. Shit. Yeah, you ain't gonna outrun them in a fucking semi. Oh shit, she's gonna kill him. Let's move. The truck was almost here, but now it's going the wrong way again. Go on, Randy. Go on, son. <laughs> Wait for your Uber Eats. Jesus, she whooped his ass. <laughs> I don't get it. It says the truck is right here. Uh, there it is. <laughs> oh, shit! Stop! Give us the drugs! Ah, oh, not them again! Get in the truck! <laughs> whoa, whoa, wait! Oh, Buzz. I love episodes where it stands Dad and the kids. That last what two minutes? Wait, what did you say? I said we're not going to be critical of anyone for their weight ever again. Are you serious? Yeah. Look, you guys, that's all I've been wishing for this whole time. It all worked out, you guys. Kyle, guess what? What? You're a fucking dipshit ginger. You got fucking freckles, and your religion is a goddamn lie. Shut up, Carmen. You, uh, <laughs> you. Oh my god! <laughs> Why does Carmen get what he wants? You've got Pakistan all by yourself, <laughs> young man? That's right. I've got a lot of catching up to do. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> so there we have it. Another awesome South Park special. Did we expect anything less? I don't think so. Um, was this as good as the Prime one? I don't know. I mean, the Prime one really tickled me because I'm a cotton upset. I'm like, what do they call it? Were you permanently online? Like... So, and a big, not a very big fan of Logan Paul. And so to see him get made fun of, like, tickle me pink. And the whole OnlyFans thing with Randy, just fucking, God, that was so goddamn funny. Um, yeah, and this one I liked a lot because I thought they might go a lot harder on the, the you know, healthcare. But I'm British, so I really, I don't really understand American healthcare that well anyway, to be honest. Um, I know Zempic here in the UK is very much the same as over there, well, the way they portrayed it in here, where it's really only for p 
people with diabetes, you know, diagnosed at the moment. Because I know someone who did was getting it and then they stopped because they had to kind of roll back how uh, how generous they were being with giving it out. But I like South Park, they always um, they always get you talking, they get you thinking about um, current topic, current year. I support current thing. Um, yeah, you know, how do you feel about a drug that helps turn down cravings? I mean, it's got to be a good thing, right? Is it going to be a net positive for society? I don't know. I don't know. Something about it just feels wrong. Something about it just doesn't feel right. Something about not having to take responsibility for things. But then it's it's going to be a positive, you know. I just, I don't know. I mean, it might maybe reduce body fat, but it's not going to fix things like, you, you know, if you eat nothing but KFC and you're taking Ozempic, you might look like this, but surely, like, you just riddle with all the salt and all the cholesterol. Like, I don't know, does it bring down cholesterol? It can't stop salt and the fact that you're not getting any vegetables, right? So you'd have to be taking multivitamins as well. And, you know, and dairy, you know vegetables fruit so it's all it's really going to do is make you look better you can eat and drink whatever you want but look like you're okay i don't know man it's tough maybe well if it does down cravings maybe no i don't know i don't know i always make the joke that if uh, if i had no taste buds i would just eat carrots because you get the texture and it doesn't matter what stuff tastes like right like i kind of wish for no taste buds because then you not you can't it doesn't matter what you crave you might as well just eat vegetables because everything tastes the same so no something about it but let me know what you guys think down below please you know drop a comment what do you think of a zempic something about it just existentially doesn't sit right with me it just feels like how in brave new world they're all drinking soma and just spaced out their goddamn mind and you know food's been designed where you can eat and eat and it doesn't do nothing i don't know it's if there are no consequences for things What's the point? Definitely got my noggin jogging. But yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you enjoyed my reaction. It's good to be back. Hopefully I'll, well, I don't think I'll stay back. I'll, you know, try and figure out what I'm going to continue reacting to. Find some more movies. Maybe finish the John Wick series. You know, let me down, down below what you wanted me to react to. Uh, maybe I could go back and rewatch South Park if that's something you'd be interested in. But um, yeah, please like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you want to keep seeing my reactions when they come out. Uh, and as always, have a great day. See you guys later. Bye-bye.